UWIN Connect 2017 is a rebranded version of the UWIN program from the previous administration. At this stage, we commend the federal government for the continuation of the program through the Federal Ministry of Finance, targeted at empowering young entrepreneurs. One of the two specific objectives of the UWIN Connect program, amongst others, is to yearly build capacity of over 55,000 budding entrepreneurs, increase the firm's growth by 20%, and employment of participating MSMEs and startups in Nigeria. We have no doubt that funding and capacity building are mutually inclusive. The government has succeeded in the capacity building aspect of the program, but it is yet to make any impact with regards to funding of MSMEs and startups. The average Nigerian knows that the desired impact of the government for the economy without funding makes the skills achieved through the capacity building program partly meaningful. UWIN surveys conducted by university scholars show that previous beneficiaries of the program, UWIN 1, currently employs over 7,591 staff, UWIN 2, over 6,000 staff, and UWIN 3, over 11,000 staff. Further research has shown that without financing, most respondents will be, be years behind in growth or be forced to shut down their businesses. It has been statistically proven that the contributions and activities of MSMEs and startups are the backbone of any economy's growth. In the mix of factors of production, we are already enthusiastic entrepreneurs willing to apply ourselves, procure pro production spaces, create employment that will trickle down to the local purchasing of raw materials, but there is no capital to back this up with common economic growth. The multiplier effect of government spending on MSMEs and startups will cause a positive change in the aspects of employment generation, taxes remitted, contributions to the GDP, reduction of youth idleness, amongst other benefits. We bring to the notice of the federal government that funding is the pillar of every aspiring entrepreneur and it is unjust to go through all the processes asked of us just for certificates of completion, leaving a critical aspect of growth and empowerment, which is funding. Funding our businesses cannot be overemphasized or understated. We will not downplay the efforts and resources expended in getting to this stage, nor the seriousness of having our businesses funded. We would intensely pursue this lawfully and doggedly until there is a conclusive win from all parties involved for the greater good of our nation's economy. National Youth Council of Nigeria, being a body that tries to bridge the gap between the government and young people, is hereby calling on government of the Federal Republic of Nigeria through the Federal Ministry of Finance to see to it that promises made should be kept. That we want to appreciate them for having trained these ones and also congratulate these ones who have emerged successfully winners and they have been certified, which means that they are, have, they are credible. I so much believe that if given the needed support and the funding, that they will be promoting and encouraging the local content policy of the Federal Republic of, Nine, of, the, of the present administration, uh, I call on the government and all the relevant agencies and the Ministry of Youth Development to see to it that they will also lend their voice to this and see that the needful is being done. Thank you.